yes, we are playing more fun, chill games. Now, how does the music sound? I'm really trying to balance that out, doing my level best. So I hope it's good for you. Let's get into this now. Do we skip the tutorial? We do not. The auto save slot. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got it. If you have an progress, blah, 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 blah. Continue. Yeah, yeah, okay. I've heard weird things about this game. Let's see. Wakey, wakey, sleepy bones. Let me get my...
Let's see, how do we do it? RT drag item. Wrong. There it is. We got it now. One, two. We did not need that extra hole, so... Let's go ahead and get you in there. Yup, cool. Perfect. Now once those seeds are planted, you have to tend to them to help them grow. Here, take this watering can and get those seeds a drink. Got it already. Yes. Correct. Excellent. And water. Might as well. Beautifully done. Lesson three, growing plants. Remember, crops need to be watered every day. That's a common misconception. But for game purposes, I get it. If not, they'll wither and die and you'll lose all your hard work. Not good. Of course, you can always hope for a rainy day to do the job for you, say. But stay there, a dick. There's something else I want you to have. You see, I've been raising three spirits in secret. <gasps> they still need plenty more training, but they'll be strong enough to keep you safe. You might have seen this before. It's your mother's medallion. It's a sort of portal to a, to a portal dimension where spirits can reside. This medallion is yours now, and I've put the spirits I've been training in there already. Pop into the medallion and choose one to have as your companion. Why can't I have all three? It isn't a test, don't worry, they're all good. Let's check. All right, electric, dark, and ice. Capacity. That is adorable. Now let's see. Looking like. Looks like power's the max, which, generally speaking, is the way that I like to go. I do like to get. All right, power. Slightly more balanced, honestly. Fire. Fire's pretty good. Sheep. 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 Okay, so it's good in fire, not. It's weak against water and psychic. Ooh, okay. 20. I think this had 33. Am I not? No, okay, I was wrong. Okay, so slightly more armor, but otherwise exactly the same. Because this is earth based. Yeah. This guy seems statistically worse. It seems like he's got one less stat point. The other had, what is it, 3 plus 3 plus 3, 9, 13, 14, 15. He's only got 14. No, he's got 13. 13. 13. Yeah, he's got 13. The other one's at 14, I'm guessing then. So, let's see, automatically gains one rage every three turns. That could be good. They're all weak, seemingly against poison. Dark and ice, I'm kind of leaning towards, I think, sheep. Anytime sheep takes fire damage, it applies burn, equal to its power to a random enemy. That's pretty good. I think this, I think this is our, this is the way to go. Yeah. I like it. I like it. That's the way I gotta go. Gotta do it. Sheep. Great choice. I thought you might choose that one. Oh, really? Thanks. I'm sure you two will take good care of each other. Don't worry about the other two. Your mother and I will take care of them. Again, uh, I would love to just have them. How about that? Sweetie. Oh, look over there. A wild spirit. This is perfect timing. Get over there and show me what you and your spirit can do. Maybe. Uh, okay, exact same thing. Perfect. Bam, let's get him. Get him. Okie dokie. Now this is supposed to be like a card battler. Looks like this gemlin. Gemlin, gemlin. Clearly, obviously, must be gemlin. Has higher speed than your spirit, so it gets to make the first move. Okay. I think that was always going to be the case. I don't think any of our guys had higher speed. Your turn. Okie dokie. Time for lesson four. Banishing spirits. You need to subdue these spirits to pacify them. They're 
not supposed to be this aggressive. The most important thing to remember, armor blocks attack damage. Reduce their armor to zero to make them dizzy and deal extra damage. You can reduce armor in two ways, two ways, two ways, two ways, two ways, using a card that removes armor or attacking with an element they are weak to. Try using Bash to reduce the Gemlin's armor and leave it open to attack. I would agree with that.
Oh, well, I'm assuming you can return here, and I'll be okay. I'll take it. You look wiped out. Did your father have you banishing spirits for him? Yes, he did. The slave driver. Of course he did. I'll make you a cup of tea, you poor thing. Why don't you eat one of those stone fruit you harvested to gain back some of your energy? Okie dokie. Open menu. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Stone fruit. Okay. Where is... I'm not seeing a stamina gauge. Uh, that's better. Now that your dad's done with you, I want to tell you about the medallion he gave you. The medallion used to be mine, and now we are passing it down to you. Your Moonstone Medallion is a sacred tool invented by alchemists that came before us. Within it lies a pocket dimension that can house up to three spirits. I guess that's why I didn't get... I guess that's why I didn't get all three of them. The spirits you keep in this medallion will come to your aid should you need help. You can also build a barn to house them in, which I think is a lot cozier. I know this is all a bit confusing, but you'll get the hang of it. Looks like that fight you had earlier got you enough experience. Why don't you try leveling up one of your spirits? You can do that by entering your medallion. While you're in there, feed them this Nimbus plant, too. It'll make them strong for your journey tonight. Okie dokie. Hold to enter medallion. Shall do. Now. Okay, there's my... Now I see it. Okay. Now I see it. All right. We're doing a cheat engine search. I don't think you can see it because I don't have my uh, display capture on, but let's see. So we're doing 106. I think we should be able. You probably heard that. But that was me searching. Feed. Now, let me think. Does it say feed a Nimbus plant? Okay. Let's feed a Nimbus plant. Boosts the power. Cool, 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 cool. And let's go ahead and level up. Now, what do we level up? Armor. Armor is pretty good. Determines bash strength. And who goes in battle? Who goes first in battle? Ooh, okay. You know what? I think speed is probably actually the way to go. All right, draw two cards. Interesting, 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 interesting. Draw two cards, that's decent. Draw one card, six damage, that's so much better. I have to, I have to go with flamethrower. That's so overpowered. We've gotta go with that, right? For sure. Thank you for doing that. Your father is all about the fighting, but you have to take care of your spirits too. Now your spirits should have the strength they need to keep you safe. Can't believe you're leaving home today. I'll miss you so much. Puppy dog eyes, but you'll only be gone for a year, right? Then you'll have completed your alchemy training. I'm so proud of you. Are you sure you're ready to go? Can I stick around for a bit longer? Oh, sweetheart, of course you can. There's no rush. But you'll have to leave at some point, and you can't keep putting it off. I know it's scary, and you have a lot to prepare. Just let me know when you're ready so I can see you off. <laughs> Okie dokie. I want to make sure that I've, you know, adequately harvested everything. I'm guessing the... No? Okay. I think we're solid. Let's talk to Pops one more time. I cannot talk to him again. He will not talk to me. That is very traumatizing. Okie dokie, so we're done. There's literally nothing at all else to interact with. Am I crazy? Nope, I don't see nothing. Yup, ready to go, baby. Alright then, this is it. Next time I see you, you'll be a fully fledged alchemist. So I did lose all those seeds, you son of a gun. <sighs> gift for you, kid. I made you these tools. They're not much, but they'll get you started out there. Now give your dad a hug. <laughs> We're both so proud of you. <laughs> Alchemist Ted. Here's a few seeds from the garden. I've been saving them for you. Thank you. Plant them as soon as you settle in, okay? You
you bet. Yo, Nathan, for your <laughs> big adventure. <laughs> Still doesn't make up for what I planted for you. Just remember, we'll be with you whenever you are, wherever you are, wherever you decide to call home. And we love you so much. And I'm so proud to see you following in our footsteps, sweetheart. You're going to make a great alchemist. Remember, all alchemists share a love of things that grow. That applies not only to your crops, but also to the people around you. Oh, my darling, I'm so excited to see who you grow into. Just promise me you'll be safe out there. The world is changing, becoming more dangerous. I promise. We need you back in one piece, okay? Well, the wind is starting to pick up. So you see, this, this is fun. You're putting your kid out on an actually dangerous adventure where they go out into the world and establish themselves. We are, I have to, I mean, this is sounding so, like, out of character for this game and stuff, but we're, we're missing that. We really are missing these rites of initiation where you actually have to confront real, you know, danger. You have to overcome an actual challenge. Yeah, we're missing that. It's not good. It's not human. It's not normal. We're not built for it. Well, the wind is starting to pick up. I guess it's time for me to let you go. Time for the final lesson. Charge that broom up, then release its energy to catch the wind. And be safe, okay? We love you. X to charge. Ah. Bam. Pow. Oh, man. I thought we were really going to rock it off. That was that was as anticlimactic as possibly possible. Generating world. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Don't worry. We only have to do this once. Building islands, placing shrines, and adding dungeons. Don't worry. We only have to do this once. Thanks for waiting. Thanks, 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 thanks for waiting. And thanks for watching. Thanks for waiting. Thanks for watching. Now, I don't know. Should we be doing stuff like this? Obviously, you know, kicking your kid off a floating island with a magical broom is not something we can do. But yeah, should we be pushing our kids out early into the world and do these types of things? I kind of, I don't know, you know? I mean, I think probably actually yes, but to be honest, it should also be something where, you know, you're giving them actual, real, you know, challenges to overcome in a real sense and therefore they're actually building that sense of you know it's normal to confront and overcome a challenge because I feel like I didn't get that I know I didn't I know I didn't really get that and I'm old so you know I probably got more of it than most people you know coming up nowadays yeah especially like in my socioeconomic situations yeah you know you have it too easy and then you end up getting it way harder it's weird how that goes what's that light over there oh there's a town off in the distance finally I hope they need an alchemist so okay we're not a silent protagonist because I really need to get off this room I think I'm getting splinters that would be something that I would have zeroed in on immediately get out some fine grit sandpaper polish that puppy while the wind is getting really strong is it supposed to be this hard to stay on the broom oh no I think I'm losing control how do you land this thing oh wow <laughs> oh no oh no there goes my brand new broom Ugh. and I dropped the tools dad gave me and mom's seeds oh my god you suck I guess I'm not leaving here anytime soon I hope this isn't a bad omen I'd better uh, look around and see if I can find the tools and seeds I dropped. Okie dokie. What does this say? Okie dokie. To complete my alchemy training, I have to spend a year away from home and embed myself into a community of my choosing. I guess this quest is going to stay on my to-do list for a while. Spend a year away from home. Enclosing area fences will prevent spirits from spawning in that area. Is that telling me harvest? Oh, 
harvest you. Okay. I'm trying to see what these little dots are. I don't really see anything for these dots. I will collect you, Moonstone. Adorable, delightful, fantastic. We really need to go on a grid-based search pattern here to make absolutely certain that's something stone fruit seeds, I'll take it. I will take my flax. I'm still trying to figure out where my, okay, there's my stamina, it's 300. I got it, I see it now, and there's an ax. Okie dokie, excellent. So we really just need to be uber careful here and just go over every square inch of land to make sure that we get absolutely everything. I can hit this with a hammer. Excellent. Oh my god, what the heck just happened? Oh, it's too late. Ah, oh, Try to get to bed before 2 a.m. Snap. That's not good. Oh, that's adorable. Spirits discovered, spirits tamed, spirits banished. Save and go to sleep. Okay. Oh no. You're up. Are you okay? I didn't know that was going to happen. I saw you drop out of the sky last night, and then I found you passed out on the ground. So I got Quill to carry you here, and I was worried you weren't going to wake up, but you did. I guess with that getup, you must be a new alchemist. How exciting. Or a new stunt performer. Anyway, you can stay in the spare room if you need somewhere to crash. I do. Thank you very much. Oh, sorry. I shouldn't have said crash. That's really insensitive, isn't it? I mean, you can sleep here if you want. I have to charge rent eventually, though. Oh, and I think these are your tools. I'll just leave them here for you. Thanks. I found them scattered all over the place. I hope it's okay that I picked them up. Maybe you could get your tent set up on the north side of town if you clear a space for it. Don't be afraid to chop down trees and cut the grass if you need to. Then you'll have a place all to yourself. I guess you could set it up on one of the outer islands, but there are wild spirits out there. Before we go any further in this conversation, I see that my money has changed. Uh, let's pop you over to 56, and I get nothing. Okay. No clue. That's fine. That does mean that I'm totally screwed. Let's see. So exact values are weird. I want to say they're doubled. They might be doubled. I'm going to go. All right, so instead of 156, we'll go with 112. We'll search for 112. And we will attempt, next time it moves up, to remember that. I don't know if it is, though, because, again, this is a really weird game where everything is, like, encrypted and stuff. So I think all the values might be encrypted as well, and therefore it's, like, impossible to find these values and then cheat them. Uh, if I'm able to, if I'm able to find them, I will cheat, like, instead of taking it easy and being like, oh, okay, well, let me just give myself, like, 5,000 coins, I'm gonna give myself, like, 100 million coins, so I'll never have to do this again, but as far as that, I think that's literally the only thing I'm gonna be able to cheat, I think maybe you should take it easy for the time being, anyway, take your time getting up, you seem pretty bruised up, but I don't think anything's broken, I might have some work for you, too, so come downstairs, or when you're ready. journal. Let's view that journal, baby. Place tent. Find a moonstone. Did that. I should use my tools to clear a spot and set up my tent. Then explore the island and see if I can find any moonstones. Mom told me they glow at night and there's usually just one stone on any given island, so we already got that. Awesome. Fantastic. Fantabulous. Very happy about that. How much can we Oh, I haven't introduced myself. 
My name is Osono, and I run the tavern here on Moonstone Island. Come on by anytime. Well, anytime we're open, I mean. Oh, I've got something for you. It's a crafting recipe called a... for a cell crate. Build one and place it wherever you can set up. You can drop anything you want to sell in there, like crops or items. I'll book it, pick it up at the end of the day and pay you for everything that's in there. If you want more recipes, you'll have to find them, I'm afraid. I hear mines and dungeons are a good place to start. Oh, one more thing. Can I ask you for a quick favor? I also need some stone to rebuild some minor basement damage. Don't ask. If you have time, could you bring me some? I kind of want to ask, but sure. Thank you. You're a lifesaver. Just put the stones in the cell crate and I'll pick it up. Cool. Talk. Let's chat. No, we sucked. Oh, we're good. They're done with talking for today. So we beat the odds. We screwed up so bad. Dish of the day. Interesting. Say goodbye. A back to work for me. I can't open this. Anything we can pick up. Oh, well, you're new. Huh, weird outfit. You must be the new alchemist. Indeed. I am Guyana. I work in the conservatory. If you don't mind, I have somewhere I need to be. Talk. Let's just... Yup. We suck. How are we... We are, like, weirdly beating the odds here in terms of, like, losing... Sweetheart, your dad thinks I'm silly for writing a letter so soon after you left, but I had a horrible dream that you broke your broom. I would never forgive myself if anything happened to you. I'm sure you're fine, but I left you a crafting recipe for a balloon in case you're not. And don't be afraid to build bridges if flying is too scary. When your dad was a new alchemist, he only used bridges to get between islands. I hope you're doing all right, sweetie. Love, Mom. Kisses. Thanks so much, sweetie. Bye. So we want to cut grass like fiber, cloth, balloon, fly off balloon. I think we can do that already, perhaps. Okay, so we need a few more stones. Cloth. One, two, three. Bam. We can pop a balloon, maybe. Now I do have DLC for this. I'm guessing that's what's going to be in here. Yes, it is. Mother Spring 2. We already got that. Okay, cool, 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 cool. A letter from the Alchemist's Guild. Congratulations on your first day as a new alchemist. Please remember that you are now a representative of the Alchemist's Guild. The following misdeeds will lead to disciplinary action or expulsion from the Guild. Giving flying equipment to untrained citizens. Throwing spirits off islands. Eating spirits. Forming an army of spirits to overthrow a government. Good luck with your year of training. Thank you so much. Dear customer, congratulations on your subscription to Mailco and your current ownership of a brand new mailbox. You can now receive letters through the mailboxes in your town and even craft your own. Mailco, it's good to get mail. Okie dokie. Let us, let's smash a couple more rocks here. Let's hit you. One, two, three, four, five. Not great. We need a few more. Let's see. We could just kind of mine it. I'm guessing that didn't actually really help us, so let's go for the smaller ones. Let's go for smaller stones. Yup, that works. Okay, that is enough for us to make the... Oh, no, on, almost. Do we have an axe? We do have an axe. Let's go up here. We're supposed to be on the north side. So let's go ahead and grab all the stuff we can grab already. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, excellent. Okay. 
96. 96. 96 is 90 plus 90 is 180. So 196. Am I right? No. 192. Yes, I hope. Oh, snap. We got it, baby. We got it. Eat that. Trying to stop me from cheating. Okay, we want it to be an even number. So let's go with nine. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nine million. Biggity, 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 bam, baby. Eat it. Okie dokie. So we should be collecting stuff up here. Cool. I think, I think this should be, we've got all of the stuff, right? I'm thinking yes. Let me see if this flowering stuff gives us different. It does not give us different stuff. I was curious about that. Okay, here's a map. I like it. Treasure map. We gotta check that out immediately. Map of buried treasure. I don't see it. I'm guessing the interior of that stuff. Okay. I don't see it. Do we want to go further? I'm kind of curious to see how. Yeah, I'm very curious to see this island is, and I do want to match it all up, but I don't think there's a huge reason to do that right now when we should be using our time to build stuff, so let's do that immediately. Let's get back to where we were. They said the north side of the island. Is there anything specific? Place a tent. I think we're gonna go where they said, which was north of town. I like that. There's a good bit of stuff here. I feel like this is a solid place to go. We... Yeah. Relatively central. Not, not incredibly so, but enough. I do want to just go down here and grab that cattail. I want to see if I can get it. This cattail. Let me try to harvest. Cattail, excellent. That's what I wanted. And then, yeah, let's run up here to where this spot is basically already open for us. Yeah, this is a good spot for it. So, now we cut. too bad. I was thinking that was going to take a really long time. It didn't. It is starting to get slightly dark. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Do it, baby. Do it, baby. Do it, baby. How much wood? I've only got 22 wood. Gonna need a little bit more wood. Uh, let's quickly...
we want to just smack stones for like the rest of the time we're here. Oh snap. Not what I was going for, but I'll take it, baby. Heck yes. So clearly they did want me to put my stuff there because they gave us this secret entrance. Nice. Okay, let's hit this guy. Stone. I'm guessing this is going to have ore and stuff in it, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Can we get... Let's just try to get this, this treasure chest first. I will come back, and we will mine this out, but first I want to get this treasure chest. I'm guessing we can craft better... Oh, okay, here we go. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Crafting recipe for a torch. That's what I wanted. I'm guessing. Let's see. Let's take a gander at our stamina. Bam, that's about as good as I want to go. Okie dokie. Let's check you. How many stones do we have? Um, let's put 21 stones in there. Oh, I actually should have checked how many stones she actually wanted. I don't actually remember. 20. Okay, so we only sold one extra one. I'm fine with that. Um, yeah, I'm okay with that, actually. Should we go for you? I'm kind of thinking no. Because the stuff on the bottom will actually give us better stuff. But this stuff is up. Here. Okay. Getting pretty exhausted. Let us eat what eats. Stone fruit is what we eat. That's pretty good. Okay. Cool. I'm pretty happy with that. Let's get in here and try to... I'm gonna try... to make this move as far as we can. say we are about I'd say we're pretty close to about as far as we can go can I get around you I can actually knock you out much easier excellent pretty exhausted can I go around you I can 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 do I attack you I think I do attack you I'm gonna get you first excellent okay I should be able to take this guy out. Level two, level two. Not bad. Okay, obviously we're bashing here. And actually we can double bash. That's perfect. Fantastic. Bam. And then one. Fantastic. That's it in turn. We're missing our flamethrower. Probably, but that's okay. We got fireball, two random. Okie dokie. These are all ones. Two fire damage to two random enemies. I'm assuming that means this is gonna double. Hopefully it does. One, two, it does. Excellent, perfect. That's what I was hoping for. Perfect, 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 perfect. Oh, I should have tried to. I, you know what I should have done? I should have tamed him. Should have tamed him. Should have tamed. Okay, I think for now it's actually not a bad idea to get out of here and tackle this again in the morning. Let's sleep. I don't know. I'm guessing this is for storage. Purely to be sold for coins. Sold for coins. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, we should be. You know what we should be doing? We should be popping those down. I don't think I have a watering can. I do I have a watering can. I do have a watering can. You know what? We'll do that tomorrow. Sleep for the night. Yes. I do not want to get knocked out. But yeah, let's sleep for the night. That's pretty good. Item sold. I'm pretty happy with that. No dungeons cleared, but there's only 30 dungeons that are cleared. That's kind of fun. Progress has been saved. Fantastic. 
Biggity bam. All right. So I'm guessing that means that what I want to do here is sell all of these guys in terms of all those gems. All right. Osono's a newsletter for people who are new in town. Issue one. Hello. Osono here. Welcome to Moonstone Island. This is a newsletter that automatically goes out to everyone who moves here like you. Step one is settling in. Get to know your new neighbors. Some people might even have jobs for you, which is great because then you can get money to spend at the tavern. That's all for issue one of Osono's newsletter. Stay tuned for more. Delightful. Let's ditch. Right. Sell red. Sell blue. Sell purple. Yeah, 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 yeah. What is this copper? Okay. Boosts the speed of a spirit. Can I? I don't know. Okay, I think I think that actually does make sense here. Let's go ahead and do our level best. seems like a daily, that seems like an obvious daily quest move right here. We would like to talk to everybody. Opens at 12. Gotcha. No, I'm not renting a room. You're not good enough friends to enter their bedroom, so they're not awake yet.
get in. Let's do just get all the items that we can get. 7 a.m. tomorrow. Okay. Let's do meet everybody we can. Hello. Oh, hi, you're new. Welcome to Moonstone Island. I run the shop here and I can help you with supplies and stuff. Oh, and I'm Rowan, sorry. <laughs> Let me know if I can help you settle in. Yes, indeed. Chat, chat, chat. Backity, backity, back. I should get back to it. You should. Osano again. Hi, thanks for collecting all those stones for me. The basements never looked better. Here's a little cash, so thank you. Unrelated, the dish of the day today is really good. Oh, there was something else I wanted to ask you. Have you checked out the dungeon yet? No, but I did see it. It's northeast of here, near the hot spring. None of us have been able to go inside in a while because it's full of wild spirits. But that kind of seems like your thing. I've heard there's treasure and stuff in there, too. Go check it out and let me know what you find. Thanks, will do. Good luck. Talk em, talk em, talk em. And say goodbye. Let's check them out. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, what can I steal? Come on. That's a bedroom. Okay, okay. Not a good enough friend. I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Not a good enough friend with anybody. No friends at all. Forever alone. Okie dokie. So, items. Oh, that's interesting. What the heck is this? Interesting. Okay, choose a talisman. Feed to a spirit to add. Remove a card. Add a new card. Upgrade a card. I think upgrade. Let's do that. Medicaid. Okie dokie. That's pretty good. What about over here? Let's check the sign. The sign does nothing. I am grabbing you. Also grabbing you. Probably a good idea to straight up, like, you know, explore this island. Oh, hey, new guy. Oh, hello, you must be that new alchemist everyone's talking about. I have always wanted to see an alchemist's regalia in real life. Oh, wow. You sound impressed. Nice to meet you. I'm Professor Zed. I run the Science Center. You should drop one seen a few spirits. I'd love to talk research with you. Oh, before I forget one more thing. It just so happens that I was recently awarded a grant to study the spirits that inhabit the outer islands. It's pretty dangerous work, and uh, let's just say I'm more of a labs kind of scientist. <laughs> so if you're up for it, I was thinking we could help each other out. I need you to tame a spirit. Any spirit. I'm not picky. Excellent. This is why I didn't tame that spirit. I knew there was going to be a, a quest relating to taming spirits. I did not forget about taming spirits. I was picking my battles because I am a genius. I need you to tame a spirit, any spirit. I'm not picky. You see, I can't do the dangerous field work like you can, but I can handle the boring academic bits. As a thank you, I'll have Paolo draw up some blueprints for his spirit barn, which you can use to house spirits. And you'll get a credit on the paper, too. Uh, sure. Talkity talk. Chit chat, chit chat. Okie dokie, turn in spirit research. Okie dokie, that's fine. I'll take it. Oh, thank you. I will analyze the data and will send you a letter if I find something interesting. Keep up the good work. Ba 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 ba. Hi, baby. And that's their bedroom. Let's see, can I? No, okay, I was wondering. Let's check our map. Should we explore this island more, or should we... I think we want to get into the copper mine and mine up as much copper ore as we possibly can. I think that is our best option right now, to be perfectly honest. And should I... The real question here... I'm really wondering about is should I attempt to cheat these items part of me wants 
to. Part of me definitely really wants to. Let me check it. Alright, let's check. Alright, so... Our last value was doubled. So 7 times 2 is 14. Let's check. Um, actually, you know what? We know now that our values are stored as 4-byte values. So... Let's narrow it down to that. I'm not gonna break up any of those bigger rocks because we've already found a nice little mine. We're slightly going the wrong direction, but here we go. I probably went a little bit too high, if we're honest. Okay, and we are, we need to focus entirely on the coppers. That's what I wanna mine.
chests, so we've, I would say, finished this mine. Obviously, we do want to get all of the good rocks to mine, and we want to get all those knocked out as much as we can, at least. We want to get all the copper ore that we possibly can so that we can upgrade all of our tools. Yeah, and I'm actually, I'm just straight up, I just focus purely only on the copper. That's it, it's the only stuff we're actually looking at. Let me eat a stone fruit real quick, consume, excellent. I mean, the iron ore is definitely important, we definitely want that iron ore. But, I don't think we need it right now. Let's go. Where are we going here? We've got one lily pad. You shit, not what I wanted to do. Damn it. Hang on. That was totally not what I wanted to do. Crap. Can we Ah That's fine. Let's get you. Absolutely. I'm also going to feed my 
sheep. You. Fantastic. Now, the question here is, do I keep that? I don't know. I'm kind of thinking I don't. I could be wrong, though. I could easily be wrong.
do bash. Absolutely. I bash. I bash. Then I fireball. That's the move, baby. Oh, snap. Holy crap. I was not expecting that to be that effective. That was super effective. Okay, obviously we have to... See what 
this is like a gardeny type thing. Again, we've yet to, ooh, interesting. Ah, oh, interesting. <clears throat> Jade plant. We've definitely got the coinages. So we can use that. Let's check, oh, I don't think I talked to you today. No, I didn't. Those clothes, you're an alchemist. I'm so glad you arrived at last. Perhaps a little behind schedule, but no matter. You're here now. I'm Cleo, and I'm Moonstone's resident historian and scholar. Any questions you have, come to me first. We shall chat you up, baby. We're gonna riz her up. Okie dokie, this looks like it's something. Warp whistle. Admire. Let us admire you. Excellent. Does that? I'm guessing that gives us the warp. Okie dokie. Let's check what else we got over here. That's something. That's cool. You in here? You're not in here. Excellent. We probably should have spent today exploring, but to be honest, I'm happy we collected... I'm very happy that we actually went out and collected the copper. <gasps> bam! Moonstone again. Ba -ba 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 bam, baby. Yes, give me... Oh, no. Inventory is full. Oh, crap. Seriously? Stamina minus 20. Really? Actually, I don't want to throw them all out. What I want to do is I want to sell them. But we don't really have... I don't, I'm not at my spot yet, so I can't do that right off the gate. That's okay, though. We will be very soon. We'll be getting them super soon. Now, did I... Actually, you know what? Here's the funny part. I don't actually think... I did. Okay, so that was 14, 38, so 76. Okay, actually we do have values. Four copper ore. That's very interesting. That's actually super interesting. I'm guessing we're not going to be able to fully, you know, get that. So we've almost got a straight up full inventory at this point. So I think at this point it's getting close to midnight. It's getting close to... Yeah, I think it's time to get back to our spot and get ready to turn in. Yeah, I think it is. I think it's getting ready to turn in. Um, we shall sell our... Let's sell it. Yes, sell it, 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 yes, sell, yes, sell, yes, sell, yes, sell, yes, sell, yes, sell, yes, hell yes, sell, yes. We'll also sell our gems. And that is pretty good, actually. I'm pretty happy with that. Let's go ahead and sort. We don't want to sell any of our buried treasure maps. We saw that. That's slightly different. Okie dokie. Close at night. I like it. What other stuff do we want here? Sprinkler's pretty cool. That's actually quite nice. Okay. 
I would say that we are. I would say we're done for today. Yeah. Let me see if I move. Let me see if I split. Let me split. Okay, that's 37. Let me see. Was 76, now it's 48. Okay, I don't think that value is going to work. It might. It might. Let me store this and see if that changes it. Be down to 74. It would, it's not. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Just checking. See what I can cheat. Can't cheat that. We are going to sleep.